What I have here is a 1971 Cutlass Supreme with a 350 Rocket V8 in it. I bought this car from Kansas City, complete with original factory build sheet. I repainted the car, done a little work to the engine, and, and the upholstery on the inside. This is a nice old ride. People always stop and want to look at it, thinking it's a cool car. It has a functioning 8-track tape player in it, so we can jam to Elvis as we're going for a ride. I went garage sailing to find a matched pair of 1971 vintage license plates to have authenticated on the vehicle. And those are legal, they're authenticated through Lansing. Well, my oldest daughter, she drove it for a while and she figured out there's a needle clicker thing on the floor and she was driving around clicking it and unbeknownst to her, she was flicking the bright lights on and off. So that's how they did it back in the 70s. My plans next for the car, I'm thinking I've had it 20 years. I'm thinking I need to give it a fresh coat of paint.